In fact, you can go up, really, his hair is nothing but a couple of spikies. You can use consummate bees. <laughs> really, just think everything's angry. His hair, his hair is angry. But in this picture, he's only got one eye. Feel free to add a second somewhere. <laughs> Again, angry eye. <laughs> Next, we'll draw the neck. It's just like any other neck except he's, he's got stripes. He's got a stripy, angry neck. I think it's uh, I think he consistently has strep throat. <laughs> No. Oh, by the way, the beak is gold. <laughs> the the hair is black. Black. Yeah. No, the, it's blue now. Uh, the the eye and the neck are red. Oh, Again, got it, got it. strep throat and anger. <laughs> Once you have completed the bird head, that is the last part of him that has anything to do with a bird. <laughs> if you got ahead of yourself, you have no one but yourself to blame. Wait for the goddamn instructions. I see. Ray was that kind of student. <laughs> there are no do-overs in art class. These are erasable sharpies. We're good. Control Z. Next. Control Z. <laughs> Next. Next. He has your generic anime schoolboy uniform. You know the one. <laughs> I just drew that. Yes, I do. <laughs> It is not military in any way. He only uses one button. Ironically, it's the one up by his nipples. <laughs> not the one near his non-bird crotch. I am very confused. <laughs> Two buttons only. One near the nip. Two butts? Buttons! <laughs> Thank you for spelling button. You're welcome. <laughs> if you need to spell it out on your paper. <laughs> Be sure to add that he has a collared undershirt and a tie. The tie goes into the jacket. <laughs> <laughs> this is going to be amazing, by the way. <laughs> Jacket now. Well, school jacket. School, it's part of the. You've seen anime uniforms. You know, this is his summer uniform. It's gonna be okay. It is long sleeved. And angry. And angry. <laughs> Everything's angry. Even the folds in his shirt are rebelling against humanity. <laughs> We're getting there. Calm down. <laughs> All right. Once you get the jacket down, I'm assuming you haven't added arms yet. Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Aside from the fact that there are long sleeves, which should have been a hint, you now when you draw the hands, which are not bird hands, <laughs> he has human hands. Angry human hands <laughs> with an angry human body. He doesn't even have wings. No wonder he's pissed. <laughs> this bird man literally got the short end of the stick, genetically and personality wise. I, there is no ruining. There is no movement. <laughs> this bird looks like he needs help. <laughs> He's in pain. <laughs> He's got 
just regular parents. They're not angry. In fact, she probably got them from Walmart. They're just regular parents. He doesn't even need a belt. Who needs a belt at this point? When you're this angry, you might as well free ball. <laughs> He does, however, have a, a very professional-looking pair of shoes. Max, can you give me another piece of paper? Yeah. <laughs> run out of space. How did you run out of space? <laughs> it's a bird dude with human features. We'll find out shortly. It's not Jabba the Hutt. Hey, very detailed. Okay. Oh dear. So we're double layering this. Is that what you're telling me? <laughs> Just think professional looking shoes. They're brown. Uh, I have brown. Which is uh. the, the color of professional. <laughs> oh. Alright, he needs another hand, doesn't he? <laughs> Two hands. <laughs> Two angry human hands. He has two more hats? No, just the two. Someone's hogging the brown. Sorry. And so as a reminder of what the original looks like. Of course, <laughs> make room for the angry cat. 
pants and the very professional shoes. Well done, sir. Coco Yanny. Well done.